Hi everyone, I am Rosie of uh, MNH Crochet Creation. So today I am here to show you how you can make a crochet crib mobile. For that you need uh, amigurumi toys like this, which is not very. Uh, make your toys like uh, about uh, two and a half to three inch, and not more than that because then. Uh, you can hang many of them if it is too big then you will not be able to hang uh, too many so these are my toys and for decoration purposes I have made these pom-poms you can use beads also or any other decorating items you will need a hook wooden hoop like this you can uh, get a, if you don't get a wooden hoop you can find the steel ones also and then you can wrap it up with the yarns and uh, use the steel ones also I like this one and I have used 12 inch ones because I have got many toys and uh, if you if you want you can use a smaller one if you have a smaller uh, if you have if you want to hang less toys so this is 12 inch hoop what I am going to do is divide since this is a circumference of 36 inch I am going to divide this into 6 equal halves which will give you a 6 inch gap in between I have made a hoop already to show you how this can be done so I have made this for I have attached the yarns like this over here actually no this is okay so this is how it will be that the knot will be down so this is this has six inch gap here equals six inch six of them and I let one yarn hang from the middle too so that means there are seven and the, you have to make sure that from here to here also it measures six inch or maybe more as per your need but it has to be equal so that when you hang it like this it doesn't uh, go off balance if it is if some some of them are longer than the the rest then it it goes off balance now what you need to do is when you make a knot here you leave a long yarn like this hanging so that you can stitch you can put a needle here and stitch your insert your toys like this from here and you can make them hang it I will just show you how this is done take a tapestry needle And now first we will insert uh, a pom-pom first make sure that it comes through the middle
okay just uh, pull this little slightly down and make a knot so that it doesn't slide okay there you go now you uh, take this and insert it from here and uh, push it so that it comes out from the base here okay okay there you go just about a uh, an inch gap and then you make a knot again make a knot once more now you take one more pom pom Okay. So about this much gap. Make sure that your yarn has gone through properly. And then you want to make sure that you put a knot here. Make a double knot to be very sure that it doesn't slide down okay okay now you take this from here insert the needle from here and take it out from here Because the needle is blunt so it's taking some time
ಮತ್ತೆ ಇವು ಲಿಟ್ಲ್ ಗ್ಯಾಪ್ ಹಿಯೋ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಯೋರ್ ಒನ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರಿಂಗ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ನಾವು ಯು ಪುಟ್ ಅ ನಾಟ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಆರ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಪುಟ್ ಒನ್ ಮೋರ್ ಪಮ್ ಪಮ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಐ ಥಿಂಕ್ ಐ ಎಮ್ ಗೋಂಟ್ ಟು ಪುಟ್ ಒನ್ ಮೋರ್ ಪಮ್ ಪಮ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಸೊ ಫಾರ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ no i think i will not put a pom pom so i will just make a knot here the reason i am not putting one more pom pom here is because i don't want the height to be too much it has the height has to be just right so that it doesn't you know hang too low this is it and now you cut your yarn and you make the rest and finish all the rest of your divisions here like this in the same manner i will finish this and i'll come back I finished my crib mobile and as you can see there are six divisions I put two toys on each pom pom and at the last minute I decided to put the beads too and I also used the center space for bigger toys uh I decided to put the beads because then it helps to if you put it here and make a knot then it doesn't slip If you don't want to if you don't have beads you can just put double triple knots and let it hang Hope you like my video please like and share thank you for watching